A gift from Cecilia O. Free piano lesson on Carl Czerny Opus 599. Practical exercises for the beginners. Learn piano with Cecilia O. Detailed, continuous, and systematic instructions. We are going to do today number 64 in Cherony's book. I have two key signature, B flat and E flat. E flat is the last one, that is the fourth note of the key. From there, you come down four steps to find the key note. So, when your music has more than one flat sign in key signature, find the last one. One previous one is the key note. So in four flats, last one is D flat, one before is A flat. So this music is A flat major. So we have two flats. So B flat is the second to the last. That is B flat key. Let's play B flat scale. B flat is this. If possible, Avoid your thumb on B flat. All black keys. It's kind of awkward because the thumb is a little too short. So you play with the second finger. Then one, two, three, one, two, three, four, four, three, two, one, three, two, one, two. Okay, you always do that. You have to flip over one, flip over one, flip over three, over one. So you are playing B flat and E flat. That's all you do. Okay, left hand, three with B flat. And four. To today's music. 64 in Cherry's book. Let's play left hand alone. B flat major, that's a tonic. So you have a tonic, three majors without changing it. Okay, let's go to dominant seventh. Okay, F, A, C is missing in this case. But E, so, this is dominant seventh. Inversion, of course, so you are playing. Okay, that's four majors all the way up. Then go back to tonic. Okay, now in this case, you are getting off the E flat, so make it natural, E natural. So it will be C, E, G, B flat. So that, that is dominant in F major, one, two, three, four. Mm -hmm. Okay, F major is this. One, two, three, four, five. That's a dominant seventh. So from here on, we are modulating from B flat key to F. Let's play right hand part. Both hands together. And two and one 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 and two and
felszó. second page the right hand part from here to here two measures are continuation of a chromatic scale in previous page in chromatic scale you play all the black keys with the third finger okay just like here 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 okay you have to manage it to do third finger on the black. So you go three, three. Okay, now let's do left hand part. So you have to think this, you don't have E flat anymore. The modulation starts. So B flat C E. That is C E G B flat. That's five steps from F. One, two, three, four, five. So that's time into seventh inversion. And that's tonic inversion. And super tiny, one step up. And tiny. And dominant. And tiny. Let's try next one. That's tiny. F, A, C. Again, tiny. Subdominant, which is fourth up. One, two, three, four from F. Again. Mm -hmm. Okay, tiny seventh. Let's do both hands together very slowly. Okay, let's do it from the previous page. E and going up. to the next line that's tiny and subdominant one more and tiny seventh okay let's go to the next part tiny seventh one and two and one and two This part, when you want to reach out here, you have to make it this one, three, four, three, two, one, turning into one, then switch up. Da da da, one. That way you can reach it. If you go, then you have to jump. Reach out. And the same thing here. Da 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 da, one. Okay, that way you can go on. You don't do that. Mm -hmm. 
That way it goes smooth. It's very simple. Let's try both hands together now. Okay. Go to the last page. Left hand. That's Tanya. Seventh. Some dominant and tiny in B flat. Up to here it was F major. Do you remember that? B flat to F modulate. And from here on going back to B flat. So original key. Super tiny. Dominant seventh and tiny. Okay, both sing together now. One, down, pop, pop. from the beginning to end. up today's lesson here and looking forward to the next one have a nice day bye bye